Hello students and welcome back to bankexamsfeda.com. My name is Ramandeep Singh and today I am going to discuss a book list for CB Grade A 2023 exam. Book list for both phases, all the papers I am going to discuss today, right? So this is the exam pattern students. Uh, there is uh, general awareness, English language, quantitative aptitude and reasoning ability in paper 1. And then there is commerce, accounting, management, uh, finance, costing, companies act and economics in the paper two. Okay, I'm discussing the general stream only. In the phase two, there is an additional subject of descriptive paper, but uh, quant reasoning English is not there. Uh, general awareness is not there. Okay, so uh, this professional knowledge, this section, this is the syllabus for uh, these papers the same. Again, there is commerce, accounting, uh, management finance costing companies act and economics right so let's discuss the book list the uh, the foremost thing quantitative aptitude and reasoning students there are a lot of books available in the market a lot of books some of the books uh, available in the market by arun sharma right uh, one of the very popular book see students arun sharma's book is relevant for cat it is way more difficult. It is not relevant for you. It is a best-selling book, but it is not really re uh, relevant for you. Sarvesh Kumar Verma's book is there. Uh, Arun Sharma's book is there. They are more difficult than required, right? It is not required at all. RS Agarwal's book is more than sufficient for you. A lot of questions are there. A variety of questions are there. Uh, there is another book called M. Tyra. M. Tyra's book. Uh, it's very confusing book. I do not recommend that anymore, right? M. Tyra's, Arun Sharma, uh, Sarvesh Kumar, Verma, uh, Sarvesh Kumar, Verma, SK Verma. I do not recommend all these books for quantitative aptitude. Just follow R.S. Agarwal, simple. And also for the reasoning, follow the R.S. Agarwal's book. These books are good enough for quantitative aptitude and reasoning ability. I personally recommend them now. Their uh, recent additions are really good. If you have an old RS Agarwal's book, buy the new one because the old books are not relevant. I mean, old books are outdated. Uh, in the latest uh, editions, they added a lot of new questions, right? So RS Agarwal's books, they're good. For English language, uh, generally, I would say you do not need any book for English language. So if your English is already good, I don't think you need any book, right? So if you are able to uh, read and comprehend a paragraph and uh, read and comprehend uh, the Hindu, if you are able to read that, and if your grammar is good, I mean, if, if you already know that your grammar is good, then you don't need any book. You just need to practice some questions and you can do that from a test series, right? But if you feel that you need a grammar book, uh, Ren, uh, Ren and Martin's book, this is a standard book, uh, a lengthy book. But if your English is good enough, do not waste your time here because it's a very lengthy book. I mean, if your English is good, no need to buy any book for English language. Okay. For general awareness, uh, I won't recommend you to buy any uh, printed book for general awareness. Because uh, we keep on updating on a daily basis. CV Grade A, GK Digest, it's a monthly capsule that is uh, published by Team Bank Exams today. It's available on bankexamstoday.com. Very good study material if you have started your preparation for CV Grade A. Okay. Uh, the companies act, uh, see students, a lot of books are available in the market, but personally, I do not recommend them. They are really complicated. Uh, a lot of analysis is given you are not going to appear for a you know a law exam so i would highly recommend you to follow the bear act uh, the bear acts they are uh, you know they they have been written in a very easy language easily understandable available online for free right that's another good thing personally i teach companies act and i go through bear acts right companies uh, act available online for free uh, do not download the PDF. It's available on MCA's website, Ministry of Corporate Affairs. It's available for free, right? So just read there or just follow our notes, okay? 
इकोनॉमिक्स बाय उमा कापिला इट्स अ गुड बुक आई रिकमेंड दैट ओके और इन केस यू डू नॉट वॉन्ट टू गो थ्रू उमा कापिलाज बुक एन सी आर टी इज ऑल्सो यू नो इट्स अ नाइस बुक एन सी आर टी इज इज रियली नाइस फॉर इकोनॉमिक्स ओके मैनेजमेंट सी इफ यू आर रीडिंग एन सी आर टी देन यू नो इट्स नॉट गुड फॉर मैनेजमेंट प्रिंसिपल्स ऑफ मैनेजमेंट राइट फॉर प्रिंसिपल्स ऑफ मैनेजमेंट एल एम प्रसाद बुक इज द मोस्ट कॉम्प्रीहेंसिव बुक I have seen and I have uh, I have gone through like a dozen of principles of management books in last 7 8 years I have been reading a lot of books on principles of management but I personally recommend LM Prasad's book very nice book right just go through that uh, and then accounting NCERT again NCERT it's it's a good book just go through that i would highly recommend that right uh, you just need to know the basics right and then for accounting standards uh, acai right whichever accounting standard you need to do uh, the institute of chartered accountants of india just go through their module right the basic module that's all no need to go through uh, uh, to go into depth but the basics you you are supposed to know for costing and fm khanjan's book is really nice uh, cost accounting and financial manage and management accounting uh, there is a combined book by khan and jan and that is a really nice book i personally recommend that uh, but there are a lot of lengthy questions in these books i mean which you are not supposed to do right so which make uh, you know these books uh, sort of irrelevant right so one thing i want to tell you students for the paper 2 the for paper 2 all these books are management uh, costing financial management even economics uh, they are kind of overkill right you are not supposed to go through the entire books that is why there are courses right uh, for uh, descriptive paper business standard is there and you are supposed to you know write your essays you are supposed to get it evaluated you you are supposed to find somebody to evaluate your essays that is why uh, you need to buy a course right i mean if you if you go to market buying ncrts and you know reading lm prasad khan jain they are lengthy modules you'll get a lot of knowledge but trust me if you are joining the course the sebi grade 2023 course by team bank exams today no books are required no books are required at all we are providing complete video classes for all the subjects we provide the complete notes notes are available in the downloadable format and then we provide uh, the complete syllabus coverage of phase 1 and phase 2 we also provide descriptive paper evaluation full length test series is there we also provide the quizzes everything is available on bankexamstoday.com you can access the course from your android device from your ios device from uh, a laptop from an ipad from all the devices you can access the course you can access the video classes notes and the test series right so uh, in the previous year in 2021 uh, all these students they took our courses and they cracked the sebi grade a exams i'm really really happy for them So, in case of any doubt, you can drop a WhatsApp message on nine zero six seven two zero one triple zero. This is my WhatsApp number. Drop your message here. All the links are available in the description. Link to join the course is available in the description. So that's all for today, students. Subscribe the channel and like this video. Thank you and have a very nice day. Bye bye.